at the Mac Tools Gator Nationals. It's round three of the NHRA Powerade Drag Racing Series, but it's round one for Pro Stock Bikes. That's right, first time that we see them in 2004. And here are the matchups in the Pro Stock Bikes Lab, presented by Lucas Oil, Matt, or Andrew Hines, Matt's brother, uh, with the lane choice over Karen Stouffer, GT Tonglet with the lane choice over Gino Scali. And yes, if you're a Harley Davidson fan, you may have your first all Harley final. It's GT Tonglet in the right lane, Scally in the left lane, Parker. I spoke to Gino during the turnaround, and they realized to take down the V-Rods, the bike will have to be perfect, and he'll have to cut as close to a perfect light as possible. A lot of pressure on this champion's shoulders. The other riders on those V-Rods, they're much more relaxed as they pull up to the start line, Marty. These guys are three and three against each other in career head-to-head -head racing. Scally won the last matchup at Reading. The wind light to GT Tonglet, and Harley is halfway home to an all Harley Davidson final. 7.11 seconds, 187 miles an hour. Scally, a very good 7.14. Now we're ready for Karen Stouffer in the left lane and Andrew Hines in the right lane. Karen, what a story. They are out of money right after this race. If they don't find sponsorship, they're done. Dead even off the line. Uh-oh, Karen's drifting. And guess what? Harley is guaranteed. Listen to the crowd. 7.118. Andrew will have lane choice by one one thousandth of a second. And Harley is guaranteed its first ever Pro Stock Bike victory. Boy, the Harley fans are going crazy as well they should. I mean, this bike is, both these bikes have been stout all weekend long. You know, last year they were running very good, but they didn't have the kind of power at sea level, which we are now, as they did up on the mountain last year. Now they have their sea level program working tremendously because they're making a tremendous amount of horsepower. Both bikes run 7-11 to meet up against each other in the final. It's going to be a great drag race either way. GT, two years ago, you guys brought out the Harleys. The quickest you went was 7.57. You didn't qualify. You were mortified. And now two years later, both Harleys in a final. Yeah, well, I mean, I wouldn't have thought that a couple years ago, but, man, this Screaming Eagle, Vance and Irons, Harley Davidson is flying, and Andrew over there doing a good job. I'm trying to ride as best as I can for Falicon, uh, Comp Cams, can and Clash, Matco Tools, everybody. Thank you. And, Andrew, this team got its first round win ever in NHRA last year at this race. You've seen how your dad and your brother, Matt, have worked so hard. It's got to be gratifying for you. Oh, man, this is great. We came out here last year, got the first factory back, Harley Davidson, in the show. We went two rounds. I told myself this year I wanted to go two rounds farther at each race this year. So that's what I'm looking to do. We got cert quality check certified pre-owned Ford on the bike now. We got everybody out here. Matco Tools, Harley Davidson, Vance and Hines, Screaming Eagle, Screaming Eagle guys are great. This is going to be awesome. One of these bikes is going to win this race. God bless America. All right, here is the final matchup, and look at that, by one one-thousandth of a second. And just look, there's Willie G in the back there, the gentleman with the hat and the beard. And look at the celebration going on at the strike.